It looked like a tragedy unfolding on M6 near Broadmoor Avenue this evening after a semi smashed into the back of a car with three little kids in the back seat. But tonight, as News 8's Leon Hendricks shows us, everyone involved is going to be okay. The damage here, incredible. The expectation, perhaps, when a semi truck slams into the back of a car on the highway. What you don't expect is this. In the crumpled back seat, there were three kids. They survived. And here's the proof. Two of the youngsters in the arms of Kent County Sheriff's deputies. A third was taken to the hospital, but all will be okay. I was surprised, quite honestly, yeah, that they were in as good a condition as they were. Take a look at these skid marks here in the road. They show you just how far that car was pushed. Now, we spoke with the truck driver who ran into the back of the vehicle. He says he simply didn't see it stop there. He says his only message for other drivers here is to pay attention. It's, it was dramatic. I mean, it was a significantly serious crash. Officials say traffic had slowed in the westbound lanes for some reason, and the semi-driver simply did not. He's seen here, both distraught and relieved. The scene snarled traffic on M6 near Broadmoor Avenue in both directions, but the story has a positive ending, while it looks like a tragedy. Thankfully, it was not. I'm not really sure what saved these kids, but they were very fortunate. In Gaines Township, Leon Hendricks, News 8. Three people were taken to the hospital, two of them flown after a head-on crash near Hastings tonight. This happened at about 6 on M37 near Campground Road. A pickup crashed head-on with both a, a car. Both drivers and a passenger of the pickup were seriously hurt.